Okay, so we're developing two hands at the keyboard. You should be able to do this, which is the same as this middle section here, where you do that 16 times. 13, 14, 15, 16, C, E, G. And this really is the bedrock. You've got to get this secure so that you can do it almost without thinking. Now you have two choices, right? You can either, five, six, seven, eight. You can either add the left hand, which is these notes happening at the same time. Take the whole thing a little bit slower. Okay, so this is, you're looking to get it really nice and smooth. We're now gonna go to the C. Back to the G. You need, sometimes when you're starting out, you need that little bit of extra time to get your notes. Then you have the G. And then you finish off with the G again. Okay, and then, we, and then we repeat round. So that's option one. You can do the walking bass and the chords. Option two is that you move the chords to the left hand. So you should know what these are, but just in case you, you don't and you're just visiting here to try and raise your game, which is good news, I'm just gonna write these on so you know what they are. So <clears throat> what you can do is you can move the chords to the left hand. So that GBD is now in the left hand and you then have the right hand free to do the, to play the tune. Again to that G. Uh -huh. So both of those are the same. That's you playing with two hands. So then you're starting to get into three stars. And if you can get that faster, then you can be sure of the three stars. If you can play maybe the bass line and the chords, and your partner can play the chords and the melody, then you're starting to get into four star if you can play that in time together. So that's the first video on playing the melody.